Well, a local beekeeper has a lot of honey on her hands. That's unusual. But so is what the honey looks like. What's the buzz? Who better to get answers than our Seth Kaplan? These are the three of the hives that we have. For Kay Walters, and beekeeping is serious, but a serious hobby. Do you sell your honey? <laughs> no, we don't. We've never had enough honey to sell. At least not in the past. Usually we have two buckets and they're filled maybe up to here. Well, this year we have had four buckets of, of this size. Look at her kitchen and she's not done with the harvest and it's not just the quantity. So it was that color. This is this year's honey, much darker. All from about the same number of bees as usual. About 40,000 in a, in a complete hive. Like this one. Or in there, yep. Multiply that by these three hives. That's more than 100,000 bees here. And would you believe this story might have something to do with another flying insect? This lantern fly. Spotted lantern flies, or more precisely, their excrement is food for the bees. Sure enough, here's a video I shot just last weekend, not positive of exactly my daughter Abriana there and I were witnessing. I'm pretty sure that this is the safest time to get near a wasp. None of this changes the fact that lantern flies are terrible, but they're a bit less terrible for bees. It gives them a food source so they continue to produce a lot of young. And honey, that looks more like this. It makes it darker, more like a, a motor oil type looking honey. Nothing wrong with eating it, even if not everyone would want to. I don't like the flavor. Which Gary Carnes, an eighth generation beekeeper, said puts him in the majority, which is why he keeps the honey he sells lanternfly free. The majority of my uh, bees have been moved north uh, into the northern part of the state in lower New York to keep my honey uh, uncontaminated. I tried both. Let's see, so this is the lighter tasted more like typical honey. Right. The darker different, but I thought fine. People who like coffee seem to not like or don't mind the flavor taste at all. Which, well, yeah. Seth Kaplan, ABC 27 News.